to use character AI all in one full guide. Now, to use character AI, the first one is what is character AI? Character AI is a super chat which chat like a human and also makes you feel comfortable. Now, how to use character AI? Character AI also has a website and also an app. But here I will show you how to use the app. You can apply the principle in the website. Now it's like you reach character AI app. Here, click on it. Now inside the character AI, first the first process is to sign in using your email. Now the first thing I will show you is to, to create a character. To create a character, click on this create. Here you see characters. You can create a character, you can create a group where you can put in characters, AI characters. You can create personal, which will make the character AI to feel familiar with you, like to know you. Do you describe what you need the character AI to know about you by clicking on this personal? Personal, you see it, and everything you need the character AI to know about you, your age, your color, everything, the music you like. To make it familiar with you when chatting by clicking on this create and then this voice by clicking on this voice you can clone your voice but this feature is not perfect yet you can clone your voice and each time the character AI describe an information it will describe it as your voice it will be like your voice by setting up this feature now to find other character AI, the second one, which is by clicking on this S Pro, you will find other character AI here. And also here, recommendation. You can also find a character AI that can generate image here. You see it. But what it does is to generate prompts you can use to generate email. Like if I ask this character AI now to generate create an image of a woman create an image of a woman that is singing you see what I asked the character AI to generate now I'll click on this generate this icon here now wait for it instead of generating the image it will generate the prompt that I will use to create the image you see it or it will give me a link which is not yet clickable but this very depending on the character ai image generation like this one ai pokemon generate this one if i ask it to create the same image you create exactly the same prompt you see it now let me test it now click on the respond icon wait for it <laughs> see just create a prompt for me to use now i will test this prompt by copying it and then open my ai that is generating image for me like this which is called kusel now let me test if this prompt is perfect by clicking on this generate an image and then paste the prompt and then click on respond icon like this now click now click the respond icon as you can see the ai generates a perfect prompt for me to use you see it now that's how to find other ai characters even the one that can generate image which is prompts to create a character ai what's at the end to know how to create the character ai or check the link at the description section now to find your notification the third one click here Here you find a notification which is sent by character AI app. The fourth one. You find character AI settings by clicking here, this setting icon. You find character AI settings here. In preference, you can turn it to light mode. You can change it from stable to preview to answer more faster. You can change the language select any language you want here and then click on this good icon after selecting it 
you can remove your account or sign out or export data here you see it you can also change your bio here now to go back you can go back by clicking on this arrow icon on the top side here you see it the fifth one you can also find your character ai bot by clicking on this chart and then you see the chart also you can upgrade the character ai app by clicking here this plus icon to upgrade it if you are using the app if you don't have the money to upgrade you can just you can just click on this skip now to skip out you see you can also find your profile by clicking this icon here you see it here you find your character ai also you can set it by clicking on this icon here to set your character ai here to set it anyhow you like to set it change the name change the greeting change everything about your character ai also here i will show you how to describe what you want the character ai to be working on here you see my description if you want the character ai to be focused or to be specific in one direction here let's close here now click on image generation in order for your character ai to be able to generate image or to create prompts now after setting it you can click on save now this is one how to make your character ai to be specific to one tax now here open your search engine by minimizing here type in your search engine app.coso as you can see here now click on search now here inside now click on this chart Ask the AI like this. Only what you will change is cooking. You change it to your own need or what you want the AI character to be specific on. Now, using this name, gentle shadow, you can put now here in name, put your character AI name here as a character in AI character in short description. Now, what you will do next is then click on this respond icon here. And then send it wait for the reply as you can see it have generated you see it what you will do now is just copy it like this and then click on copy now go back to your character ai now click on this setting icon here in your character ai now slide you reach description now click on the description now add it here by pasting it and then click on close and then click on save Now, anything you add this character on cooking, it will reply it accurately. Now, let me try one example. I'm asking the AI how to cook chicken nuggets. Now, let me click on this respond icon here. You see it. You see how it is working. You see how the AI is generating it for me. You see it? Now here it is. To cook chicken nuggets, preheat your oven to 200 by C, 390 F, or set your air fryer to 180 C, 350 F. Arrange the frozen nuggets on a baking tray, for the oven, or in an air fryer basket. Spray them with a bit of oil, or shake the basket. Bake 14-16 minutes in the oven, or 7-8 minutes in an air fryer, until they're golden and crispy. Check that they're thoroughly cooked before serving. Now, like, subscribe, and click on the bell icon for more AI tool tutorial and application guide. Also, watch the video on the screen in order to know how to use this Kosu AI tool. Here, thank you for watching. See you on the next video. Peace.